Hey everybody, happy Masters Month. It's finally April, the clocks have changed, it's staying lighter later, and I hope you're getting out to play more golf. I'm Mike with Hanson Fitness for Golf in Irvine, and I wanna give you a easy five minute routine that you can do to get your body ready. So many times we see people run from the car, pay their green fees, run to the tee, and they blow up on the first hole, and there goes a couple strokes. So if you have your body ready five minutes, let your buddies tee off first, and you do this five minute stretch, you're gonna play a much better round of golf. Okay, so warming up for your round, we're gonna do this right in place. You can do it behind a stall, you can do it on the first tee box. I recommend three things. Of course, you're gonna have your driver with you, you're gonna have a mid iron with you, and if you could get one of these small bands to throw in your bag, it's gonna be huge just for, to help you stretch out. So what you wanna think about is you wanna stretch out the big joints that you're gonna be using for the next 18 holes or the next hour of practice. So you're gonna make sure you get your shoulders warmed up and your hips, and then we're gonna warm up some of the rotation. So the first thing you wanna do is small shoulder circles forward. You always wanna start forward and never go up over your shoulder joint. Just keep them low and then back. So we're gonna do about 10 to 15 of those back and forth. And then we're gonna cross them over our arms. So we're really warming up the shoulders because that's such a huge part of your golf swing. Next thing you're gonna do is grab, you can use a mid iron or you can use a driver, either one. And then you're just gonna go side to side, holding onto the ends of it, letting your lower body turn both directions as far as you can. Once you've done 10 to each side, you're gonna keep your lower body stable and then turn. So now we're working up the more the thoracic or the rotation of the shoulders. The next exercise you can use driver. I recommend using the longest club in your bag or the band. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna hold onto the band and we're just gonna go over our heads, keep your arms as straight as we can, getting a big stretch in the chest and shoulders. That's gonna help you to turn more throughout the day. And then once you've done that, we're gonna go all the way back and then you're just gonna do that rotation again. So now we're warming up the hips just a little bit more this way. Okay, and then once we've done that, we're gonna take the driver again. We're gonna hold on to the head of the driver, put the club, the handle down in the ground. We're gonna put our right foot behind our left leg and rotate around that. This is a great stretch to get that hip. So if you're a right-handed golfer, you're gonna get that lead hip going stretched out. Then we're going to switch sides. We're going to go right leg, left, knee is going around. I recommend 15 to 20 of those. That's a great exercise to get that stuff going. And then the last one we're going to do is just a simple, you're going to bring your legs as far as you can and you're going to push side to side. So we're going to do this. It's just a dynamic stretch for your hip joint. Do that three to five minute warm up before you play and you're gonna play a much better 18 holes. You're gonna start off warmed up and you're gonna feel better throughout your round. So there you have it. There's your three to five minute warm up that you can do You're in the parking lot, behind a range stall, in the, on the driving range, or on the first tee box. And when you play your best golf from this, I wanna know, so let me know you've shot your best round after doing the warm up. And if you'd like more tips like these, please visit our website at hansenfitnessforgolf.com and check out our blog.